Hi beauty babes, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys a step-by-step -step eyeshadow tutorial, so please do keep on watching. <music> Before I start with my eyeshadow application, what I like to do is I grab some tape, just a small piece, and then I take the adhesive out. That way it won't hurt your face. I place that at my outer corner, so just like that. So for today's look, I'm only gonna use one palette, and that is the Violet Voss Essentials palette. To start, I'm going with the shade Terra Coda, right here. Then I'm grabbing my Moto Pro BMX 430 brush. Every eye shape is different, as we know, so this is not a step to take for every eye shape. Mine is an almond shape kind of eye, so what I do is when you open your eyes and then you have this dent, that's where you should apply this color. So that will be your crease. So you apply and then you blend in circular motions. And then you wanna drag that all the way to your inner corner. Well, almost, right at this point. You're applying that and then you're doing circular motions to blend that color out. What I like to do, I start with something with a shade lighter as your base, and then I'm going with a shade cinnamon with the same brush. That's going right at your outer crease, blending upwards, meeting that lighter shade. So it's the same step, but lower. You blend that color. This will make your eye appear bigger. And you're gonna repeat the same steps. So placing that at your outer corner. Just blending them out in circular motion. Bringing them closer to the inner corner, but lower. So you're gonna have something like this at this point. So what you can do is grab a clean, fluffy brush. Right where the two colors meet, you're going in circular motions. So you're grabbing the brush very low with very light pr pressure and you're going in in circular motions just blending those two together i want to add some color to this look i'm grabbing the shade emerald i'm going in with my moto pro bmx 466 brush going in with that shade right where your eyeball is so you're placing that you're not blending it out right now. You're just packing that color and kind of moving it up and sideways. So I'm repeating the same steps for my other eye. Just where your eyeball is. Pack that and move sideways and upwards. Right where your crease ends, you're going to end this color. At this point, I'm going back in with my cinnamon color with my 430 brush and kind of like going over it again and blending these two together. I'm going in with my Luxie 121 brush. I'm grabbing that cinnamon color again, but I am placing that right on my inner corner. And then just blending the green and this color together. Okay, so your eyeshadow should look something like this. For eyeliner, I'm going in with my Hank and Henry eyeliner. What I do is I start from the middle, then I do the inner corner, and then I do my outer corner. I'll show you right now. If you haven't already, please don't forget to like, subscribe, 
and hit the notification bell to see more. After you apply your eyeliner, you can go ahead and take off the tape. So I'm applying the Ardell Wispies lashes off of camera and I'll be right back. I'm back with my lashes. So for today's foundation, I'm mixing two shades of the CoverGirl Simply Ageless foundation in the shade 241 and 225. Just two right here. Apply two pumps of the dark. Well, one. And some of the lighter shade. And then I'm grabbing my Luxie brush in 510. So I'm grabbing some of the light, some of the dark, and mixing them together. So today I'm mixing the e.l.f. 16 hour camel concealer in the shade light peach and medium sand. Going with the medium sand first. Then I'm going with the light peach and I'm placing like three dots. This will make my hooded under eyes just pop out a little bit more by that shade being lighter than your concealer. What I like to do with my concealer is I kind of like pack it. So I pack that right under my eyes and then I spread it out. So I spread it out to the size of my nose, a little bit low, lower. And then I like to go into the sides of my eyebrow okay so i'm grabbing my air spun placing some product and putting that right under my eyes okay so i'm going with my wet and wild contouring palette grabbing the brown shade luxie brush in 131 for my face contour i'm going with my alamar complexion brush I'm going in with my Becca Hydramis Set and Refreshing Powder. I'm gonna grab that and place it right under my face contour. Grabbing my powder brush from Real Techniques, I'm gonna blend everything out. Going back with my Essentials palette, I am grabbing the shade Dusty Rose with my Motor Pro BMX. 420 brush and I'm placing that throughout my whole under eye for my inner corner I'm going with a shade cream for blush I'm going with my note desert rose going with my blush brush from Mill techniques For highlight, I am going in with my Steve Laurent Jelly Highlighter in the shade Prosecco, please. And I'm just gonna grab my fingers. So I'm grabbing my ring finger. Then I'm going in with my Ulta Glitter Glitz Glitter Eyeshadow. For lip liner, I'm going in with my Avon lip liner in the shade T520. To finish this look, I'm going in with my NYX Dewy Finish setting spray. Thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed and learned something from this eyeshadow tutorial if you like this video please don't forget to hit the thumbs up and if you loved it please don't forget to subscribe to see more upcoming videos i'll see you soon Bye.